welcome to our demonstration video today we are going to demonstrate the main system components of a completely quick lock movable sprinkler irrigation system yeah we are going to um, install this irrigation system for some passion fruit garden you can see our passion fruits here on the other side um, yeah those are our passion fruits uh, this gentleman we are going to work with him today is going to tell us uh, where we are where we are now to recall ourselves liko chiseka no district here wengo ya mugombara chiseka oh kare sebo tuli basanyu for kuba ko farm yo rwa lero ah yeah what uh, what you mainly need the main system components um first you will need a sprinkler our sprinkler today is uh, an atom 35 impact sprinkler gun yeah there are different sprinkler guns uh, you may select one depending on the size of the land uh, the gradient the pump you have selected and the pipe so we start with our sprinkler head it comes with the different nozzles these are nozzles we shall see them how they work uh, we got our sprinkler stand you need a stand on which the sprinkler will be mounted from the stand you will need a flexible pipe or a pipe that you can easily roll and unroll that's why it is a, a movable system you can move the pipes after irrigating uh, you will need the pipes now for quick locks i mean for a quick movable sprinkler irrigation system we use this kind of connectors where after we have connected or after they have been connected you don't need a tool you don't need a screwdriver to unscrew and screw so we screw once so what uh, the operator does is to only open the, the the locks just like this and you separate the pipe or you separate the pipe from the stand or you separate the pipe from the uh, from from the pump and also connecting you just fix in uh, and then you lock That's, uh, yeah, that's that's why we call it quick lock. Uh, from the joiners, you will need a water pump. Yeah, now the number of pipes will depend on the distance from the water source up to the longest distance in the garden. Though we don't recommend many pipes since we want to reduce uh, um, the labor by the operator. So today we have seven rolls. That is uh, each roll is 30 meters. There are different rolls that come in different lengths. So we shall need a water pump. Our water pump today is a petrol engine water pump um, because the distance is not too big and uh, uh, we only have about 210 meters and the gradient is not too steep. We have a vertical height difference of about uh, 10 meters. You need a suction pipe. Yeah, it is good. There are different types of suction pipes, but it is good to have a reinforced suction pipe with strings such that uh, such that the pressure the suction pressure doesn't collapse the pipe inside and it's also good to have a transparent one such that you can see whether the pump is actually sucking though there are those that are non-transparent um, the rest are some few fittings some few connection fittings the one that adapt to the pump uh, you will need uh, you will need uh, well, th these are examples of some fittings that you may need, maybe to adapt to the, the pipe, to the sprinkler stand, and to the, to the pump. You also need clips. There are different types of clips. Uh, there are those that are high tensile and non-high tensile. The high tensile, they are preferred because they can work for a very good period of time. Yeah, thank you. Let's uh, wait to see how... This is my drop rating. Eh, 
Ngambak.